A son of Warren Jeffs, who spoke out publicly about his father's physical and sexual abuse, reportedly took his own life this week at the age of 26. According to a Facebook post by his sister Rachel, Roy Jeffs died on Wednesday. Now, back in 2015, he shared his story of being mistreated and shunned by his father, the prophet of the polygamist fundamentalist LDS Church, who is currently serving time in a Texas prison for sexually abusing underage girls he married. Last year, Roy Jeffs sat down with ABC4's Nick McGurk and discussed being sent to a series of labor camps as a child before finally escaping and leaving the FLDS church in 2014. I was sent from you know, a house in hiding um, to a land of refuge, which were the compounds, and that's where it was just a lot of hard labor. Um, you know, and, and you were supposed to start as young as 12 years old. The criminalization of polygamy has caused it to be um, chased so far into the shadows um, that it was it, it created a culture that was able to foster people like my dad. There is a GoFundMe campaign to raise money for Roy Jeff's funeral. We have the link to that on our website, abc4.com. He would have turned 27 years old on Wednesday. If you or someone you know is contemplating suicide, trained counselors are always available for free. You can call the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline at 1-800-273-8255 or the University of Utah Neuropsychiatric Institute Crisis Line at 801-587-3000. You can also text on the free Safe UT app.